Hi there, this is my clicker video for Clyde. He is a three-legged uh, domestic medium hair that we have here at work. Um, for clicker training him, I first started off by conditioning him to the clicker. And he's a very food-motivated cat. Um, he doesn't really like to get up very much because of um, his arthritis in his back legs, or back leg, really. Um, he did have arthritis in his, pre in his other leg before um, he fell and it came off. He had surgery for it. So basically, the, the conditioning, the clicker, and he picked, he picked that up very well. Um, and next, what we did was um, grooming. I tried doing grooming with him, and it, it goes okay. Um, sometimes he gets kind of antsy, and he'll get mad if I don't do it in certain places, or if I do it in a certain place he doesn't like, he'll, he'll swat at me like that. I try to let him know that it's a good thing by clicking. So that, sometimes he'll get, he'll get a little mad about that. Next, what we did um, was I tried conditioning me letting him touch his paw, like me letting me touch his paws, and he didn't really like that very much. I can I can pet him, and then I would pet his back paw, pet him to let him know this is something good. I wouldn't do his front. I'd stop doing his front paws because. He didn't like his front paws being touched very much, and he would bite. He would bite me. And next, what we did, we did targeting first without a keyword, and then with a keyword. And he's able to target the tongue. De I use two tongue depressors uh, for targeting. And now the keyword touch. Touch. This took me a while to get him to do it, but he, he does do it very well. I tried using his food bowl first, and that didn't go very well, so that's why I started using the two tongue depressors. Touch. Touch. And sometimes he'll get distracted and he'll start licking himself and I know it's probably he's getting tired of doing this. Touch. 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 Just away. So that's what I did with that. I didn't do um, a laser or anything for him to really chase around just because he really wanted no part of it. Um, I will, I could, I can get him to come to me, um, but with luring, with the treats, but I actually have to physically talk, I have to talk to him, and I didn't think that was very good, but um, I also worked on him with playing with a leash, because he really never used to play very much, and now he does, now he's starting to play a little bit, but just with a leash, I don't get really get him to run around or anything, just because of his three legs. Bye.